वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल इंजीनियर चॉइस ट्यूटर इन कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ एट जीरो एट सिक्स माइक्रो प्रोसेसर टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी द असेंबलिंग लैंग्वेज प्रोग्रामिंग ओके सो डेफिनेशन वाट इट टेल वाट डू मीन बाई असेंबली लैंग्वेज प्रोग्रामिंग दिस इज द लेवल ऑफ प्रोग्रामिंग इन विच द माइक्रो प्रोसेसर कैन इजली अंडरस्टैंड ओके अ कंप्यूटर प्रोसेसर अंडरस्टैंड सिंपल असेंबली लेवल But machine language understood by only computer. A program, whatever program we are writing, some command we are giving, so it will be written in three types of level. That is first high level, that only we can understand. That is English. Okay. Assembly level language that understood by microprocessor or controller. and the machine language that only understood by computer or machine this machine language is in the form of binary okay that is 0 or 1 what is the advantage of assembly level language the assembly level language is more understandable for us okay just we are giving an example suppose we want to perform addition i want to perform addition of two number or two register or something so simply i will give command add ax bx means what this source bx whatever the value of bx will get added to ax so value will be ax is equal to ax plus bx and ax also store the value of this sum so it is more reliable and more easy to understand this assembly means to assemble all data what do you mean by assembly the word general technical what does does it mean means assembling means gathering all the data either from register or from memory why we are collecting this data to communicate with the hardware whatever the hardware it is present in uh, machine present i will give the example of computer what are the hardware that is present so we are giving some input from uh, our mouse okay keyboard and we observe the output also in the form of some sign it will be readable form some sound form or image form so the use of assembly level language is that only so, so we will look one uh, example or uh, code in assembly level language that how we are going to perform the addition of two number okay so the basic thing present in uh, any code is the first step that is involved is our loading means whatever register is there it will get some data some data will be present and register will acquire that okay some data okay after that it will oper operate means some command we are giving suppose we want to move suppose we want to add suppose we want to multiply so according to the instruction is going to operate and finally we are going to get result okay it will display result is going to display or observe okay so let's start with our example means how this code will be written in assembly level language just now i told you that first step involved is our load means we want to load the value in ax register suppose ax is our register memory i will draw the diagram also suppose ax is the name of our register okay it having some address name 2001 h okay in ax what we will load we are loading means moving the data 50h in ax so the ax value will be 50h that's completed again for operating two value we need two register correct so second one i took bx and the 
bx value it will also have some address let give it 3001h and the value what we have given to bx 20 h is hexadecimal okay now we want to perform what we are going to perform here addition of two number okay so what command we will write only the addition command we are going to write and for addition what command is that add who is going to add right now ax and bx register so we have given the command suppose we have to do multiplication so we will give the multiplication mul it will be donated ax bx okay so now what inside it is giving i will show you the ax value what we have 50h bx value 20h both got okay bx is 20h ax is 50h this ax is called destination this bx is called source and we know we have seen in our previous video that always source get added into destination means destination always capture the source value what it so insidely how it going to perform the internal structure ax is our destination so it going to hold so it is going to hold x is going to hold the source source what operation we are performing addition we are performing between both so ax plus bx correct ax value will be 50 okay plus bx what how much 20h so finally what we got 70h the ax value but let's see but thing to keep in mind this 70h is in the form of ascii ascii form it is it will not give the exact 70h it will give in the form of ascii so we know for capital a the ascii code is 65 for zero digit zero we have 48 ascii code suppose i want to move to three suppose zero for zero it is 48 and i want to know the ascii code of three so 48 plus three it will give me the output that is 51 that's all uh, i will explain once more first we will going to perform the load operation means moving the value into the register that ax and bx that is loaded after that some operation we are going to do means some command we are going to put that addition i want to do here so i put it the addition command ax and bx got added and the value will got in ascii form that's all thanks for watching this video please like share and subscribe our youtube channel